Okay, so, Silver's Log number 10. Um, I don't know. I This is the 10th one of these. I hit 100 subs recently. Um, oh, and it is my two-year anniversary of Dust today. I guess at the time of recording, it'd be just over two-year anniversary for uh, East Coast people, because it's 10 o'clock right now here. Uh, that makes it 1 o'clock a.m. for East Coast people. Uh, anyways... Yeah, so, anyway, tomorrow, the 3rd of April, will be my character's, my character's, uh, two-year anniversary. Anyways, so I'm just gonna talk about everything I've ever done in Dust, I guess, or at least a brief overview of it and what's happened. Uh, gameplay here, it's me, still early times, I'm using Kaldari Sentinel with a burst HMG. I see I have a little, I have more than 500 armor. That means I'm running some sort of plate. It's a Pharaoh or a reactive, probably reactive. Uh, I don't know. I've, I use a, I use a reg now, a regulator now, because I don't know. Once, once your shield's down, you're almost screwed. Anyway, I don't know. I'm just wasting kids. This is actually, I actually get a shit ton of kills in this battle. Yeah, you know, if that's what you'd find as a shit ton, you'll see how much it is. And then I die one bullshit death at the end that I, you know, I probably shouldn't die there, but I did. Anyways, so let's get to it. Um, the day is April 2nd, 2013. I don't know if it was earlier that day or if it was earlier that week or what it was, but anyways, I was playing Black Ops 2. One of my buddies suggests that we play this new game he heard about called Dust514, and he just heard good things about it from a buddy of his. Suggests we play it, and so we go play it. I download it, I open it up. Um, I open it and it just looks all cool. I get the character selection and you know choose whatever race and all that, your gender and whatnot. Um, anyways, then I, I, I don't know, I, I don't remember exactly. I do something, then I have to go out and mow the lawn or something like that, and then I come back and I play the game and I play the game with my buddies, and we get absolutely wrecked and it's so oh, it was awful at first. I uh, didn't know the maps at all, didn't know the weapons at all, didn't know how the game worked, didn't you know didn't have the hand-eye coordination that you get by playing this game and whatnot. The muscle memory. Um, anyways, go on for what, so there were th like four guys I came here to this game with. One of them played that first day and I, I haven't played with him since. Uh, anyways, so me and three other buddies, we play for about a month, month, about a, m I don't know, it's still hazy in here because it's a long time ago, I can't remember exactly. We play until we take, we all st uh, kind of stop playing sometime in May. I don't recall if it's after. I think it's before Uprising, like so. It's early May, before the 14th of May, 2013, when uh, Dust went into Uprising, came out of beta. So um, went into. No, oh, what am I talking? About? Uh, we stop. We stop. We kind of all stopped playing. Uh, it, within that month span, I met this guy that I started playing with. His name was uh. Jedi James, the character I met him on was just a bunch of L's, so I called him Lines for a while, and anyways, anyways, so that was James, I uh, played with him for, anyways, at one point he sent me a PSN mail, I think, saying Dust was doing triple SP for a while, so I thought, oh, you know, I'll give Dust another go, I'll play it some more, so, uh, I do, I go back and play it, and I'm back on the game for pretty much good, so none of my buddies really come back, so I haven't really played with any of them since, so that's the end of them, their names were like, Lore, icy, and blue, but anyways, they're not too relevant to the story, not anymore. Um, so yeah, me and Jedi Jane, he introduced me to this channel called Clone Number One, or something like, Clone Chat is what we called it. I met a couple guys in there, um, RK Killer Joshua, he still plays, this guy named Gitwitcha, uh, 40 Ounce to Freedom, or 40 Ounce to Freedom, say his name, something like that. Um, and anyways, and this guy named Blind Shot, and Blind Shot, we become good buddies. So I play with him for a while, and at, at this time I'm okay. So let's go back a bit. When we first started the game, me and my buddies wanted to form a corp, so we did, and we, you know, nothing really happened. We only played for like a month, anyways, all of us together. So that never really happened. After I came back, I joined, in this before, uh, I guess I joined this chat and met Blind. I joined this corp. It was called. Uh, Can't even remember now. Anyways, I could probably look it up on my Dustboard if I'm not going to. Uh, anyways, do that, and then they very quickly migrate to a different core. And that that one's called uh, Dust to Dust. So now I'm in that for a little bit. Uh, meet some good guys in there. Some guys named uh, Synther Bix. Uh, what? 
this other guy, he went by a lot of names, like, uh, Eaton Bullets and something, I don't know. He was kind of a cool guy, I got to know him, I met him a couple times, you know, after I stopped, after I left that corp, he kind of stopped playing, a bunch of people stopped playing, I didn't play with him. Yeah, I met him, like, once or twice again in my Dust career, and just hung out with him and said what's up. Anyways, um, so, yeah, uh, after a bit, so, Blind, me and Blind started playing together, like, all the time, we usually play with those guys in Clone Chat. Anyway, so, he thought, you know... We should, we should try to join a good corp. And at that time, guys, don't laugh at me here. The corp we decided was good. We, you know, looked at the leaderboard, saw Sever True Bloods, like, oh, we should join Sever True Bloods. And back then, they had a 2.0 KD requirement. I meant that. I was at like a 2.1 at the time, I think. Blind wasn't quite there. He's at like a 1.8 or something like that. So we had to join their feeder corp called Neanderthal Nation. And so, you know, I guess I could have got into Sever, I don't know. I joined Neanderthal Nation with him, and there we met a lot of guys, and that became our home for a while. Um, My Time Texas, Scrapper34, Corporal Bloodstone, this guy named Jeffrey, uh, god, just a bunch of names. Yeah, no point in going through all of them, really. I'll probably get to him at some point. Anyways, there's this guy named Slim, kind of got to know him, he got kicked from the Corp after a bit, he'll come back in later. Uh, anyways, um... So yeah, we go on for a while, and it this period of time, I, it was only like two months or something, but it felt like a very long time. Like it, it was, it was, these were probably the best times I ever had in this game, hanging out with those guys, just messing around, playing. You know, we'd log on, see all, see everyone be voice in corp chat. We get a squad going, get, you know, after a bit, get the second squad going, Q sync and whatnot. Maybe even play against each other if the game decided to put us against each other. That was fine. Was still a really good time. These kids I'm playing with squads, Jesus. Um, anyways, so after a bit, we decide we're going to merge with Sever. We're all going to go into Sever and live happily ever after. Anyways, um, we join. It's complete bullshit, as you probably all know that Corp was stupid. So we leave shortly after, and not all of us leave immediately. I leave, and at this point, um, my time Texas had been playing with Shepard Gray and a couple guys from Cap for a bit. He's like, these guys are cool, we should join their Corp. So anyways, uh... He, you know, he's talking to me, he's like, we should join the corp, what do you think? I was like, yeah, man, we can give it a try. So, you know, me and him, I believe blind, and I think, like, one or two more, like, joined immediately. And pretty much everyone eventually migrates over there. There were a couple of uh, directors we had in NTN, but they, I don't know, they were pretty much loyal to Sever. They were just kind of running the feeder corp for Sever, so they stayed in Sever. They never really joined, they didn't join Cap. Uh, Jeffrey was a director, he did end up joining. He was kind of, I don't know, he was one of our crew. Anyways, um... We're in Cap for a while, I think it was like three months or something. Uh, had a good time with those guys. Uh, you know, got became associated with them. Didn't do too much. This will be my first time in Cap. And the now that I'm in it again, it's my third time. Anyways, after a while, Blood Bloodstone, Corporal Bloodstone comes back, who is our CEO in NTN. He... God, I guess he stopped playing while we were still in Sever, and then we decided I'll leave. Anyway, so he comes back, and he's like, guys, we're reforming a new corp. So, you know, we still kind of have faith in him, still have loyalty in him. So we all go and do that. We form a new corp. Uh, I think it's called, like, Black Eagle Regiment. We didn't decide on that. Anyways, and then that, and we decided to change the name again. We go back to, like, Neanderthal Nation or something, if I remember right. And that, or I think we go that one, and then Black, I don't know. Anyway, so then we joined TNS the corp. And somehow Bloodstone set it up where our corp would be, you know, we'd be the members of the actual DNS corp, head corp, you know, you know head Eve side, I don't know, whatever, head Eve side corp of the DNS alliance, which was freaking wrecking PC at the time. And I don't mean just in battles, I mean destroying PC, but I don't want to talk about that too much. Uh, anyway, so that happens. I don't know, I left Cap on fairly good terms, like a bunch, well, I guess we kind of troll pulled. Anyways, uh, so... After a while, we're in there, um, we play, I guess it's like another month or so, and then FanFest comes, and I don't know, I I don't know how much potential that corp really had, I, I don't know, we could have got somewhere, it's, I don't know, we, like, we recruited a couple good guys and whatnot, but uh, eventually FanFest came, and we all stopped playing, basically. A couple people keep playing, like, Skull Eraser was a guy from NTN, he kept playing, Ashley Swift, he kept playing, oh, with my mag not firing there, uh, and then they just, we had, like, a district in DNS, and they just, like, took it for a, their four, I don't know, any right, anyways, I get a lot of headshots here, jeez, uh, anyways, I don't know, just a lot of, a lot of us quit, like, me, Blind, me and Blind quit, Scrapper quit, um, Texas quit, Bloodstone quit, 
Anyways, after a while, I come back to the game. So does Blind. Texas never really came back to the game. Scrapper never did. A lot of us never came. There's a guy named Munchkin Slayer. We played with him again on and off. And, God, just... I mean, Blind came back for a short time, if I remember this correctly, and then he stopped playing. Um, now, I suppose... I don't know. I, I play for a while, and I don't know. I, that's... I don't know, I suppose we're in like June of 2014 now. I go on a trip, I go to Europe for a while, I come back and uh, I don't know, just resume playing. At this point, I sup God, for a very long time, the guys from NTN have been just like gone. Anyways, I don't, don't know what core. No, yeah, I'm in cap. I'm in cap. That, that's it. Alright, uh, so I think around this time I'm in cap or I'm going, or I join cap when I get back or something. Anyways, um, then, so I get back in July. In July or August or something, Shepard Gray disappears. Cap basically falls to ruins for a while until he comes back. So, anyways, he's gone. A bunch of people leave. I stay for a while, but then when absolutely nothing's happened, it's boring as hell. You know, it seems like he's never going to come back. I leave too. I go. I join a couple corps. Join freaking War Ravens because 40 ounces back from Clone Chat days. He was in there. He, me and Blindshot joined that, and then I guess that was, that, was when Blind stopped playing in War Ravens. I think. Anyways, so there's a guy named Destroyer. He was still in Cap. He was from NTN. He followed me around. He he left Cap when it pretty much died too. He joined. He we joined a couple corps. We we joined Unreal for a little bit. Freaking, we were, I don't know some bullshit. Like I don't know. We we had high hopes for that, hoping maybe we could uh, bring it back or whatever to its former glory days. Even though we were never really part of it, but I don't know. It just seemed like something fun to try to do, and then it never really worked out. The guy who uh, got us to do it was like not around much. He didn't have a mic. Anyways. So, yeah, we we hop a bunch of course. I end up in Fatal Absolution, and Shore joins that for like a short time or something. Then he goes just goes back to Cap, and Cap's kind of coming back now. Now I'm in Fatal. I'm in Fatal for a little bit before Cap starts coming back. So I kind of have some allegiance, you know, not you know, some allegiance to Fatal. I guess I'm gonna say, and I play with them. God, I'm in there for four months. I'm there while they take all all of Outer Heaven's districts. While out when Outer Heaven leaves. And I made a bunch of this. And I got, anyway, so I'm there for a while. After quite a while, they do their uh, dis their pullout thing. They've got rid of all their districts except for like a couple. And then they just like stopped doing PCs. A lot of members started leaving. Then felt it was time for me to go. I go back to Cap. Third time in Cap. That's where I still am. Um, I don't know. Just start doing some good stuff in there. Uh, get you know, make good friends with a lot of people I was friends with before. A lot of new people. To get that. Anyways, so nowadays, I don't know, just back from like NTN times, the only people that I really play, you know, I play with Ashley Swift, I play with Destroyer, I play with that guy Slim I mentioned earlier, and I play with all the Cap guys, and. God, something. Mm, I could go into so much more detail about everything, I suppose, but. Eh, nobody wants to listen to that. Um. I didn't think I would get that done in this span of this one video. Um. Yeah. What did I miss? Anything? Let's review this one more time. I come to the game, play for a month, stop playing, come back, Uprising, NTN, Sever, oh, excuse me, Dust to Dust, NTN, Sever, phone chat's in there somewhere, go, oh yeah, go cap, back to NTN business, DNS, um, Fanfest happens. So many people stop playing. God, I miss those guys. Yeah, looking back on it, we were a good bunch of guys. Like we, we were, we were pretty good at this game. Some of us, anyways. I don't know. I feel like we were kind of assholes, or at least I don't know, kind of a group of misfits. Anyways, I'm kind of the only one who's real. I'm the only one who's at all relevant in this game at this point. Hmm. Kind of depressing. It's like being old and all your friends are dead. But, uh, yeah, there's my one death there, that other sentinel. Anyway, I, I wasn't watching, I don't know how I felt lost, but it was probably stupid. I probably just missed him with one shot. Uh, anyways. So, yeah, we're, yeah. Go, I don't know, like, War Ravens, Unreal, Fatal for a while. Then, back to Cap. That's pretty much it. Um... God, what else is there to talk about? Is that all I've done? And all? I don't know.
There's so much more I could talk about, but that's just the general where I've gone and what I've, you know, what I've done. Anyway, so win that match, and as you'll see here in just a second, I get 40 kills, one death. That's, I don't know, a lot of kills for me. I, could, I don't know. Some, I don't know, some people like average more, I don't know, I'm not going to try to make myself sound better than I am. I play probably more risk adverse than a lot of major slayers, and that gets me less deaths, less kills. I don't know, I just kind of get mad when I die, so I don't like to do it anymore. So yeah, get a good score there. Uh, hmm. That's pretty much all there is to it. That's uh, kind of, anyways, two year anniversary on Dust. Two year anniversary of my Merc tomorrow. Tenth Silver's Log, 100 subs. Silver's Log number 10. See you guys.